Hey everybody, it's Gina Mayo from I Choose Joy and I'm so happy to be with you here today. I am planning on doing these Facebook Lives um, every week from now on as long as I'm able to uh, fit it in my schedule, but I really like spending time with you guys and sharing some things that we're doing in our homeschool. And today I have this really great new curriculum, well at least it's new to me, that I been using with my kids for the last couple of months called Learn Math Fast. So I'm excited to show it to you and let me check. Yes, it looks like the post just posted on my website at ichoosejoy.org. So uh, you can head over there and get some more information about it. But I've learned about Learn Math Fast. I've kind of been hearing about it in the last couple of years and I finally got it and started working with my kids who are ages, uh, my younger group, uh, ages 6, 8, 10, and 12. And what it does is it learns, you're not actually just learning math fast, but you're learning how to do math fast because you're really understanding it better. So there are seven volumes. I'm going to switch you around now so that I can show it to you. So here we go with volume one, and let me tell you that I got four volumes, one through four, with the geometry set, and I got this from the author, J.K., right there, J.K. Mergens, um, and this is a completely honest review, though, even though I got the materials to review with you. So learn math fast system seven volumes. This is the second edition. And what you do is you start at the beginning. At the beginning of the book, she tells you how to use it with different ages. So if you are starting with six to eight year olds, she shows you how to, if I, if you guys are there, can you please comment? I want to make sure that I could see your comments. So far, nothing's showing up. And I show that two people are with me. And I just want to make sure that I'm seeing your comments in case you're asking a question. Now there's four people here, so please leave a comment. I want to make sure I can see you. So you start, if you're starting with six to eight year olds, she shows you exactly what you're going to do. And if you're starting with older kids, nine to 14, you're doing something slightly different. And then if you are doing it with... high school age or older, maybe the kids are struggling to graduate in math, um, there's a certain way to do it with them. And then here's even a fast track that you can complete the whole system in less than a year. So I just love how she makes it possible to use this with different groups of students. So since my kids were in the 6 to 12 year old range, um, I did what she said here. I stayed on a lesson until they completed it. And what you do is kind of an activity to learn about it. Then there's a worksheet that you can just copy from the book. And then there's also a timed test to make sure that they've mastered the material. Let me show you real quick before I get into the book, these two promises she makes you, makes to you. Even if your student spends a week on each lesson, you will still be able to advance three grade levels in one year. So take your time. Isn't that awesome? Just working this system will really make your kids understand math better. And by the way, I'm doing it alongside my other math curriculum. We're just doing this extra because it goes back to the beginning to addition. And I still wanted to make sure that they were doing their other math. So we're doing it, both of them. And here's the other one. After completing volumes one through seven, you will be ready to take the SAT, ACT, GED, or any college placement test. So let's look inside. The first thing you're doing is going back to the beginning with addition and subtraction. She wants you to use manipulatives like pennies. And the first group, oh, thanks. I finally see a comment. It's Kelly. Yay, glad you're here. It is really great. I am so excited about this curriculum. I'm planning on using all seven volumes and doing it with all my kids. Hopefully I can get my older teenagers to get on board with it because I know it would help them too. 
So I'm going to see how I can get them to do it this summer. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Um, anyway, at least I can do it with my 12 and unders, right? So you start with the pennies, and you're learning that 1 plus 4 equals 5, and 2 plus 3 equals 5, and you go through all the different or, uh, arrangements, 3 plus 2 and 4 plus 1, and then you learn the subtraction 2 and work on the worksheet. And then here's the timed test. So they have 30 seconds to go through the whole thing here and make sure that they can do it within 30 seconds. If they can't, then you keep practicing. If they can, you move on to the next lesson. So we have gone through the sixes and the sevens, all the way up through, um, they have tens, and then adding double digits. And we got stuck at the end of chapter one. Let me get there so I can show you what it looks like. We are right here now. They cannot get this under a minute. Now, I took it myself just to see how possible it is. And I could do it in 30 seconds. So they just need a little more practice. They get hung up on those subtraction problems. They get to 10 minus 6, and they think a couple seconds before they say 4. So they'll get faster, and then we'll move on. But the whole um, book is just teaching you, making sure you understand these concepts. And I'll, let me show you the table of contents real fast. And you can see what's in book one. So you're doing all the subtraction, addition and subtraction, um, double digits, and then you get into multiplication. Sorry, it looks kind of light. I, I don't know what happened to the brightness here. Hopefully that's easy for you guys to see. And long division, division with remainders, and then the last part of this first book is U.S. Standard Measurements, length, cups, weight, that kind of thing. And the answers are in the back, so if you have an older student that's doing this on their own, they can um, do it by even looking at the answers and making sure they're getting it. Let me show you something else that comes along with book four. Hang on one second. I'm sitting in here in my car, as you can see. <laughs> book four has some geometry, and it comes with this really neat big bookmark, which has some, like, what do they call these? Um, formulas, tips, just to remind you. And a kit that has some special things in it to help you understand the geometry concepts better. So let me switch you back around. Just wanted to let you know again that I'm really enjoying this Learn Math Fast system. My kids like the, um, the competition. Now even though they're different ages, uh, they're having fun with it. My oldest daughter that is using it has dyslexia and she has trouble with math. So I'm not following the uh, speed times with her. Like I want the others to get their 30 second test within 30 seconds, but for her, I, a minute is fine. As long as she's understanding the concepts, I really don't mind it. it takes her longer. So you can make it work for you. That's one thing that's great about it. Um, and you know what? I'm excited to make sure that I understand math better too. So if you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them below, even after the video is over. And I will let JK know if there's something that she needs to answer, and she can head over here and answer the question for you. Or I could ask her and get you the answer. Um, go to ichoosejoy.org, and today is the post where I have the review, and there's some more photos and things there. Um, and if you're watching this later, just search Learn Math Fast over at my blog. And there's also some links to some places you might be able to find it on sale. So thanks for joining me today. And I will be back next week to talk about homeschool in the woods. We did some really fun 
Yeah, that math fact sheet. She calls it the big, big bookmark. It, it is really cool, Alina. So next week for Homeschool in the Woods, we're doing some fun history projects with their Renaissance and Reformation study and the Colonial Times, Colonial Life uh, Time Travelers. So I will see you guys next Monday, same time, same place. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.